Good evening, everybody. Happy Thanksgiving. It's the evening before Thanksgiving, technically, but it's the 25th. I don't know how all that's supposed to work. I thought I'd just give you a little update on uh, what I've been doing here in the shop. Um, got a little circuit that I've been working on that uh, I have built on this prototype. These are probably not ideal for a lot of sensitive analog stuff, but it helps you put together a circuit pretty easily and quickly. The way I like to set mine up, I've got three strips here and on each strip the blue is minus 15, the black is ground, the green is plus 5 and the red is plus 15. So like for example I got three zeroing pots here that are all in parallel and then I got a resistor to plus and a resistor to minus. And that way I can move each one of them plus or minus just a little bit. Uh, this particular circuit uh, is an analog implementation of the Lorenz L-O-R-E-N T-Z or just Z, I don't remember. R-E-N-Z, I think. Um, which is a, a real interesting circuit. It's a chaotic circuit in that what it generates is relatively random noise. I've got it connected to the uh, 1300 XY display here. It's real interesting the way it works. It's, it's generally the same path but it's never the same thing twice. So um, I think I'm going to build a little card to go in the, the Scanimate that that circuit. I enjoy doing this because it's real quick to prototype something. Um, then I guess the other thing that I've been playing with a little bit I need to play with my camera holder. Um, I, I've been uh, working a little bit with the Scanimate just to refresh my memory about the way some of the circuits work in there. And um, I've got a camera that looks at the CRT. I'll switch over to the... You can see my reflection when I have this little door open. But uh, this is a 5-inch CRT. It's, it's pretty sharp. And uh, I've got a 680p camera or a 1080p camera looking at it and um, what I was going to show you is that when the raster goes to a dot typically what you would find is that the scan lines sort of bunch up and get hot extra bright and that's also a good way to burn a hole in your CRT. So the Scanimate's got a pretty good intensity compensation circuit. That that from uh, becoming an issue. Looks like I got a little bit of a scan line in there because I don't have these high def cameras to the NTSC sync generator. Anyway, I just thought I'd, I haven't actually put a picture from the Scanimate 
onto one of these videos in a while, so it's still alive. And um, I hope everybody has a good Thanksgiving, and I'll catch up with you later. Bye.